Hey, what's going on out there, fishing fam? Ray Sharifi here from the Dirty Hookers. And today, it's gonna be a little bit of a mixed up video. I was just unboxing this care package that Opsin had sent me, and I realized that I can go ahead and show you guys what all I got, and also do a big thank you to them, along with two other companies that I would like to give a quick shout out to for everything they did for us. In just a second, I'm gonna be showing you guys a quick little teaser of our trip to Cedros Island. It's taken me quite a while to get these all edited, but I finally have each and every one of the videos edited from each and every day that we fished. I have five total episodes and I'm working on possibly a sixth or seven, but for sure five episodes will be dropping. And like I said, these are the few companies that I would like to give a quick shout out to, obviously. Ops and Floral for taking care of me and making sure I had all the floral carbon that I possibly needed in on our trip out there. Phoenix Fishing Rods for hooking me up with all the rods that I needed to be able to handle all those yellowtails, small and large. You gotta be prepared at Cedros Island. You're out there looking for trophy yellowtail. Phoenix Rods took care of me, made sure I was ready for that. A very, very, very big thank you to Daniel over at Redemption Swim Baits. Uh, for taking care of me and making sure I had a plethora of all different sizes and colors to be ready for the calicos, halibut, sheephead, and anything else I wanted to buy the swim bait. He hooked me up with a really big package last year, really took care of me and made sure that my dad and I are gonna be handled in on whatever was needed for any kind of presentation that the fish were biting on. And lastly, big thank you to Performance Tackle. Ken from West Coast Tuna was luckily on our boat and they take care of him really well, so luckily, they took care of us as well. They made sure that he went with anything and everything that was needed. So anything that my pops and I didn't have, Ken was able to provide us with. But Performance Tackle really went above and beyond to make sure that everyone on our boat was totally covered. Big thank you to you guys. Without further ado, I wanna keep this unboxing super short. I wanna keep it short just so that it's not prolonged and over talked uh, before the little teaser. I don't wanna lose your guys' interest. But as you saw, I already pulled out this uh, sweatshirt. And then they hooked me up with all these different line sizes, including their smaller sizes that recently just dropped. I'm super, super excited to try these out. Bass fishing is starting to heat up really, really well. I had a day fishing the spawn pretty recently and I really wish I had these in time, but all good. I'll be able to fish these throughout the summer, no problem. So got the six pound, super stoked on that. It's gonna be good for surf and trout fishing as well. So that's pretty pumped on that. 15 pound, hasn't done me wrong yet. 20 pound, you don't really need the 20 pound right now with all these big bluefin around, but once these bluefin disappear, Yellowfin takes over, Yellowtail and Kelp Patties, Dorado, 20 pounds gonna be very essential. Same thing goes with 25 and 30 pound. 30 pound can still be used right now. A lot of those 25 to 30 pound, 40 pound fish are getting caught on 25 and 30 pound. Along with 40 pound, you definitely want a 40 pound fly line rig out there when you're going out for bluefin right now. And uh, 50 pound, obviously always gonna be essential on bluefin trips. And the big thing that I am super, super stoked on with all these new spools is that from here on, all these spools are coming with these elastic bands that keep your line very, very nice and organized. Pull off too much, just take that band and slide it backwards and your line stays very nice and neat, doesn't get unraveled, doesn't get all tangled. You don't have to worry about it getting loose, getting stuck in the zippers in your tackle bag or anything like that. Fluorocarbon is gonna be very, very nicely organized from here on. With any spool that you order from here on, they're coming with these bands. He was nice enough to send me some extra bands. So big thank you, Greg, for hooking me up. There's a few more freebies in here, um, but they're not option related. So I'm going to go ahead and end it right there. Again, I don't really want to prolong this longer than it needs to be because you guys did not come for an unboxing. You came for the Cedros teaser. From here on, once a week, starting Thursday is going to be episode one. From there on, is going to be one episode after the next. So let's jump right into it. And uh, I hope you guys enjoy. Crash. First thing you notice when you're off the plane? <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Oh my god, oh my god. Oh, I got him! I got him! Gaff, gaff, gaff! He came up on it all the way to the surface.
There's yellowtail all over this shark right here. Oh, I got, dude, look at this blue shark. Dude, yellowtail are just him up. There's a shark right here and yellowtail are beating it up, hitting it in the stomach to get it to spit out food. We're catching yellowtail off of a freaking blue shark. Oh, we got two hanging right here. Oh, dude, it's big. Oh, fuck. Oh my God. Jumbo. Holy shit. Holy That's a big one. Oh my oh. God. Wow. Forty-four point five. Do you think, Ryan? Fifty-eight. Fifty-one. Oh shit! Fifty-one. Fifty-two. 